I'm told that we are the last manufacturer left in the United States that still manufactures a fully handmade boot. And our objective is to make a boot as good as it can be made. My name is Vic Borg, and I own Stewart Boot Company here in South Tucson. And I've had Stewart Boot Company since 1970. I'm in my 49th year. I'm about to get it figured out. <laughs> We do things by hand, not as a gimmick, but the human hand can do things that machines just simply cannot do. So I'm wearing a pair of boots right now that are about 45 or 46 or 47 years old. They're designed to last a long, long time. Not only is this pair of boots older than you, it's probably older than your mom. <laughs> you can't say that about too many products nowadays. Leather. There's no sense making a boot that has the capability of lasting 30 or 40 years out of leather that's going to last 10. doesn't make sense. But we use bison, that's a very good leather, elk, uh, lizard, ostrich, you name it. Anything that's got a hide, people can make a boot out of. People always talk to us about our old world craftsmanship. Our machines are old, old, old because the old machinery will do work that modern machinery won't do. And uh, so you use old machinery, old guys, old methods, it works. Y ya los años que tengo aquí, pues ya, ya son muchos. <laughs> sí. The thing that matters the most to me is the fact that I'm helping people in areas that they can't find help someplace else. People that need custom boots need custom boots, and there's no two ways about it. We've made boots for Jonathan Winters, the skipper from MASH, Arnold Schwarzenegger, Clint Eastwood, Billy Crystal and his two sidekicks for uh, the City Slickers, uh, Raul Castro. When I walked in the door of Stewart Boot Company on 14th Street uh, 40 years ago, uh, I smelled the smell of leather. Guys sitting around on milk cartons, nailing nails and doing stuff, and I thought, this looks like a real business. Mm -hmm.